Yes. Maybe. Yes, All right. So, what is the status, Mr. Uh, Superintendent of Police? Very good morning, sir. So, the FIR has already been filed on 1st of May. No, that's all right. Sir. But uh, the accusation was twofold. Sir. That uh, he had been running from pillar to post sir. for getting the FIR registered and your officers have, were not registering it. Uh, sir, uh, the officer in charge of the station, he got the uh, application. Mike, give him, post, give him the mic. I registered post on 26th, sir. 25th. On the same day, he enrolls the inquiry, but since his application didn't have the marriage certificate and proof of marriage, so he went to his uh, permanent address. He was not there, his address was traced there. Then he came to police station with the marriage certificate and the photographs, and on the very same day, sir, on 1st of May. No, that's all right. Yes, so, sir. therefore, the claim of the petitioner that he has married the lady is correct. Sir, sir. He has but produced supporting documents. Sir. That's all right. So, now that is not under dispute. Sir, sir. The offense is not of marrying a major girl sir, with her volition. Yes. Sir. The offense is that Captain. she has been kept in captivity by her own people. Uh, yes, now, sir. what have you done to, to rectify uh, that? Sir, subsequently, the investigating officer he went to yes. the, his paternal address, the paternal address. And he gave a petition to the the lady appeared to have given a written application whereby she said that this petitioner had taken certain certain nude pictures, and after showing those nude pictures, is that the statement? Yes, sir. And this is on. Where where have you brought where have you brought it? Next year B at page 12 B also. Where is it? Yeah. Next year B at at page 12. Now, with this statement, Mr. S.T. Sanjay, what do we do? Lordship may call for this the girl, my lord. No. My lord, the matter, the matter shall be investigated by the police. We are asking for FIR to be registered. My lord, your lordship will consider that this is a typed statement on which there is a signature before your lordships and this has been filed by the police here. Now, my lord, to what extent this can be believed on the other hand when there is a marriage certificate of a uh, husband and wife, my lord, and we have the audio clipping of the girl wherein she is saying that my life is in danger. Please save me. Where is the girl now? When the, when the, when the IU went because her uncle had hidden her. Now where from they for the first time they are bringing this. Now therefore it will be in the fitness of thing your lordship may call for the girl so that she can be, she will say the truth before your lordships. Because my lord, I am told that even the police officers are they are supporting the family, not the girl, Milan. And therefore, she had apprehended danger. You file a statement, but we are having. Uh, no, no, we have. We, I have stated before your lordships in Mr. my. Mr. SSP, you do one thing. Did petition. Now, in this FIR only, there is no need to register another FIR at the moment. Right, sir. Now, make investigation. Sure, sir. Whether what uh, he is stating is correct or. Milan, uh, what I submit just a is. Minute, just a minute. Just a minute. Now, with this statement, I mean. Uh, the, 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 uh, we would uh, we would straight away direct for uh, your uh, uh, FIR and arrest. No, no, no difficulty, Milord. But then uh, we would like it to be investigated. Yes, yes. So let that investigation be done yes. instead of uh, jumping uh, to any conclusions. Since you have registered the FIR, in the same FIR you can find out facts, liaise with your counterpart. Uh, please find out whether the girl is making such a statement under duress or under tutoring by, by her parents. And if it is uh, correct, then uh, make a report, send it to the court. Sure, sir. We will, we will have. Uh, if, if no, Milord, what find, I submit. If we find even a modicum Milord. of truth in this uh, statement made by the girl, Mr. Sanjay, your client will have it. I know, my lords. I know the consequences. But then, your lordship, the best thing would be that, that let the girl be produced in the court, we will. so that she can fearlessly yes. make. Milord, the we, manner in which this has been brought, right. Milord. We shall, we shall have the presence of the girl here. Yes. But only after vacation. In the meantime, you are not going to harass her. So, who, me? Yes. No, the, um, the, I have not seen the girl since when I lodged the FIR right. before that, my lord. That's no, right. my, my specific statement is, if your lordship will see, my specific statement is that she was taken in false That's context. Right. We, will, we will not jump to any conclusion. We will have the woman... Uh, uh, Therefore, in order uh, to save her here. life, your lordship may direct for her production. Meanwhile, she be protected by the policeman. That's right. We will do that. 
because i am my my instruction is that the gopal ganj police is not cooperating they are citing the parents of the girl miss this kind of no confidence on police on everybody no, no, on the parents not, not, uh, rather me not i say that it is only because of the interference of the ssp patna that this fir could be lodged the, the husband had talked with him he picked up the telephone right, we'll and say. then only when he interfered then the fir was allowed the court to but pass but his grievance is against the lord gopalganj police we'll see because and the parents are there yeah, they are you said that people. mr mr sanjay you are repeating my lord uh, you said that we will produce the girl in before the magistrate your lordship for recording her once it in patna dekhiye now what we propose to do is this mr ssp you talk to the sp of the girl should not be uh, harmed in any manner whatsoever we will record it in our order yes and uh, constant vigil shall be kept near the house where she is residing at the moment we are asking for the production of the girl on the first day when the court reopens sure sir is that right yes sir. and uh, and uh, thereafter thereafter we will record her statement only then yes. her statement under 164 shall be recorded right sir okay. All right. We'll state the reasons why why this court is making this provision. And Mila will not medical examination of the girl also. Everything shall be done. Don't worry. No medical examination now, Mila. But if we find if we find that. Oh, definitely, state, definitely, Mila. But now, so far at present, Mila, her medical examination is necessary because she has, Mila, disclosed to her husband that she has been subjected to torture. She has a scar at her face. Are you she are you aware been, of this provision of law or not? That before recording her statement, she will be examined by on her on her request, she will be examined. That's a provision in the no, court. That since my lord is directing her production on reopening of the case. Yes. So, my lord, I am praying to your lordship. Don't you don't you bother. Before she makes a statement under section 164, we will be disposing of this petition after interacting with the woman. Right, the petitioner also would be would be here. Yes, yes. And if we find that this statement is incorrect or that she has been harmed in any manner, your lordship manner, may take hardest he, action against him. I will be the last person to support such person. Right. So your client also shall be here. We will send him yes, to yes. custody from here. Yes, yes. Not if you. All right. Yes, yes. So on that assurance, we are fixing a date. <laughs> Both of you should be here. We'll see uh, yes. whether whether the statement has been made under duress or lordship or she. she uh, married you under duress lordship and she should be brought by the police not by her parents no, yes. so for the court is concerned no no she will come along with the parents yeah, but lordship. under police custody yes yes sir take that person to the order passed by this court on 20 the ssp patna is present to stop he has informed this court that the fir the fir on the complaint of the petitioner has already been registered sister the the senior superintendent of police got in contact with and came to learn that the victim that the that the that the wife of the petitioner has given a statement before the officer in charge that the petitioner had taken her nude photographs and had made attempts at disseminating such photograph on social media was stop by using it as a tool come on the wife of the petitioner was forced to get her marriage with the petitioner registered before the marriage officer was stop she could escape from the custody of the petitioner anyhow where after she and has also filed necessary documents before for getting such registration of marriage annulled mr the the aforesaid statement has been the aforesaid statement has been brought on record by way of counter affidavit which has been filed today and a copy of which has been served upon the counsel for the petitioner first up in response to the aforesaid statement made in the counter affidavit Mr S D Sanjay learned senior advocate has contended that such a statement of the victim girl cannot be believed as it is said to have been made before the officer in charge of station first of he further submits that he has no confidence who according to his information has been supporting the parents of his wife in getting the aforesaid registration of marriage aforesaid registration of her marriage with the petitioner annulled Mr. The petitioner maintains 
that uh, maintain uh, notwithstanding the aforesaid uh, government aforesaid statement of the of his wife before a response before a, before the officer in charge of kama the petitioner contends the petitioner maintains that such a statement has been given if such a statement if at all has been given kama it has been recorded under duress or on the tutoring of her parents in whose captivity the the uh, in whose captivity she has been residing for quite some time now at gopalganj stop under the aforesaid circumstances this court my lord one more submission of mine yes my lord have reported that in case before your lordship when she makes a statement if it is found to be incorrect then action may be taken against those who are instrumental in getting such you don't need indicated. to get it you don't need to get it recorded by the court <laughs> now if she makes a different statement and says that she was under duress and that no they should be known to this that also, yes. such action should be i mean they are also That's accountable right. by not. providing such affidavit before this honorable court mr everybody have, should know that nobody is above this, the law we have taken up this matter not as an adversarial litigation but yes. only for the safety of the life of a woman not she should not need not uh, be over apprehensive about anything now what did i say under the aforesaid circumstances this court considers it desirable to interact with the with the uh, with respond number 10 with whom the petitioner claims to have married in a temple no. where after the marriage was registered before the stop the senior superintendent of police is directed to produce respond number 10 before this court at 10:30 it is it is it is made clear that the respond number 10 shall have the freedom to choose her mode of transport and the company with whom she would come to patna but she would be provided all protection on the way and here at patna which responsibility shall be of the senior superintendent of police patna mr till such time the superintendent of police is directed to to uh, to to depute one constable near the house where she is residing and alert the beat police of the locality to to be to to to, to remain vigilant to stop telephone number of two of the police officers of police station shall be given to the respond number 10 which she can on which she can communicate at any time that she apprehends any danger or harm to her life first up the the efforts the contents of the aforesaid order shall be communicated to the superintendent of police on telephone by the senior superintendent of police patna who is present while the order has been dictated first up mr ashfaq mr ashfaq ahmed ashfaq ahmed learned uh, government council is also directed to transmit a copy of this order to uh, superintendent of police northwest first up the court would not brook of any any ground the court would not brook of any defense if the respond number 10 is harmed in any manner whatsoever first up the petitioner is also cautioned not to get in touch with respond number 10 in the meanwhile or try to influence her thinking or try to influence her in any manner whatsoever first up should there be any complaint against the petitioner in the meanwhile it shall be viewed very seriously a right. copy of the order may also be communicated to the girl this order so that she can think that now i am under protection all right yes you are you are you are uh, you are showing your bona fides no, this the is moment, this is important the moment, because we lord if she because we have still 20 days if she is terrorized then we lord my lord knows my lord we are not we are not reporting this in the order mr yes, sir, uh, what is your name manavjit singh dilno sir mr dello you please uh, inform your counterpart that the respond number 10 the wife should be known that uh, she has all protection and she should not worry it will be done sir all right the moment police will reach here worship she will know it any all yes mm -hmm. next the presence the presence of the ssp patna uh, is dispensed with 
after the order has been dictated this court directs for the dispensation of the necessity of appearance of ssp henceforth deeply obliged